As we begin another day, let us pause for a minute of silence. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, fellow Titans. Two tips for those of you who endeavor to be true Titans on rainy days staff and student alike we need you to leave the house 10 to 15 minutes earlier we have hundreds of walkers who will not be walking to school on rainy days it's going to increase our parking lot congestion and we're going to need you to leave earlier as a result secondly i've been standing by the front of our lunch lines and with most of you i'm grateful for your truly tightened patience when you jump in the back of the line. A few of you have decided you should jump the line in front of several of your peers. That's not truly Titan. We taught you that during the opening days of school and I expect you to do differently each and every lunch shift. Speaking of lunch, every so often the health department of Loudoun County comes to visit all the public places where food is being prepared and served, including the schools. Yesterday, our school was inspected. Miss Yakub and her term team got a perfect score for the way they're taking care of the kitchen, the preparation of our and service of our food. Comes as no surprise to me, they do an amazing job. Please let them know how much you appreciate them. Want to give a shout out to our golfers. Yesterday, they finished third in the Dulles District Tournament. Sid Bott and Liam Sheridan advanced to the regional tournament, which will be held next Monday. JV and freshman volleyball prevailed over their opponents from Rock Ridge last night in straight sets. Cheer will be in action tonight at Parkview. Opportunities to see cheer in action are few and far between. They have fewer competitions than all of our other teams. JV will be performing tonight at 6.30, varsity at 7.00. Stop by at Parkview, it's so, so close, and support our teams. Use the QR code on the screen right now to help SCA vote for homecoming court. The voting is opening through Friday. You only have this week, this week to make your selections. Use that QR code to go ahead and do so now. The homecoming dance is coming up on Saturday, October 7th. Get your tickets to the Diamond Casino Homecoming Dance during lunches. $20 a ticket in cash, which includes a free meal at the Friday night feast before the game against Rockridge. Visit the table outside the cafeteria during your lunch block to purchase your ticket. You can also use the QR code on the screen to purchase your ticket online. If you are bringing a guest from outside of Dominion High School, there is a form you'll need to complete. That form will need to be signed off on by the homeschool administrator of that student. The hallway decorating contest for Spirit Week begins after school today. And we need to get started right away for the ultimate bragging rights. We hope you'll be involved. Also this afternoon, if you're interested in Middle East and Arab culture, come and join Mesa for their first interest meeting on Wednesday, September 27th, after school from 418 to 530 in room 605. 
Everyone is welcome. There will be snacks and a discussion on future events. We hope to see you there. Between the Lines is a club dedicated to promoting literacy in the community. Their next meeting is after school today, September 27th, to talk about volunteer opportunities and their upcoming selection of a book to read. Stop by for pizza and games. The Black Student Union will meet tomorrow morning at 845 in room 413A. Everyone is welcome. Bring a friend. Refreshments will be served. See you there. In news from the Career Center, we have some notable schools arriving here at Dominion this week, like George Mason, Virginia Tech, UVA, let's go who's, Christopher Newport, JMU, William & Mary, George Washington, and more. Check your School Links account, register, and create an e-hall pass to attend. Seniors, if you'd like to tie up some loose ends on your college applications with support from counselors and Mrs. Rivera, Plan on attending the workshop during Titan Times today and tomorrow. Be sure to register using school links and create your e-hall pass to attend. I want to take a moment to remind you of the services provided by our writing center. Let's check out their promotional video right now. Hi Barbie. Hi Barbie. Hi Barbie. Hi Ken. Hi Barbie. Hi Ken. Have you ever thought about failing an essay? Do you want to try in a failed essay or do you want to go to writing center? You have to want to go to Ready Center. Hi, Barbie. Welcome to Ready Center. What can we help with today? I need to fix my essay. Okay, follow me. Hi, Barbie. My job is tutor. Thank you, tutor. No problem, Barbie. Looking ahead to October on Saturday the 7th, the fourth annual Live for Lane Memorial 5K walk will be held. Dominion's mental health club, Safe Haven, will help co-host this event, which will begin at 9.30 a.m. at Lowe's Island Community Center. Um, be a friend, end the stigma, spread awareness. On Wednesday, October 18th, George Mason University will be hosting the 23rd annual Alcanza College Fair, where students can explore educational opportunities by visiting over 150 colleges from all over the nation. Use the QR code for uh, details and to access the permission, click so that you can reserve your place by October 8th. We only have, can take 83 students. See Mrs. Rivera in the Career Center with any questions you have. Titans, remember that your life is a priceless treasure. Your presence here in our community is a gift. You are loved unconditionally. Always be truly tightened. Have a fantastic day. Go tight.